Welcome everyone. Today we are going to see how the challenge in retail industry in managing the inventory and to understand the sales trend can be solved with Bold BI and its integrated ETL. Let's see the retail industry challenges one by one in detail. So first, integrating the data from different sources such as in-store point of sale system, online sales platform, inventory management data from ERP, customer data from CRM can be quite challenging. Second, ensuring the data accuracy and the consistency of data while extracting it takes time and effort. Third, real-time visibility into the inventory levels and the sales performance require meticulous tools and systems in place. Four, from these data, forecasting demand and to optimize the stock level we are having is very challenging and thus you have a best analytics and visualization tools in place. Last one, personalizing the marketing efforts based on the customer behavior data and tracking its impact in real time. So before going in depth with an use case, we, let me show a brief overview about Bowl BI and its integrated ETL. Bold BI coupled with ETL offers a comprehensive solution for all the data processing challenges. Here, Bold BI is a powerful business intelligence tool that enables you to visualize the data and gain actionable insights out of it. Whereas, ETL process helps in extracting the data from various sources, transforming it to ensure consistency and accuracy across the processed data. And finally, we are loading the data into a centralized data warehouse. So this is a high level overview diagram where you can see that the ETL process is taken care of by the bold, bold ETL. Internally, we use industry standard tools and frameworks such as DuckDB which is used for extracting data into the pipeline and to perform SQL based transformation on top of it and we move the transformed data into the target destination. In this case, it's a data warehouse or a SQL database. By default, we are using Apache Doris, which is an open source data warehousing system. Finally, from the data warehouse, we can connect Bold BI and Bold Reports to build visualization and to get insights out of it. Let's explore a real world use case. Here we are taking an example retail corporation which is a medium sized retail company with a 50 plus stores across the country and they sell various product categories including electronics, clothing, home goods and some more items. They use several systems like ERP for centralized inventory management, CRM system for handling the customer data and a point of sale and online sales platform for sales transactions. Their primary challenge is to manage the inventory efficiently. Currently they are facing frequent stockouts in some stores and overstock situations in others. They are also struggling with integrating the data from their existing ERP, CRM and the point of sale system. So what they need is a comprehensive solution to handle the data and process it to provide simplified dashboards showing insights into sales performance, inventory levels and the customer behavior in real time to take business, business focused decisions. Let's see how we can solve this challenge using Bold BI and its integrated ETL. So the first step is data integration. Here, we are going to integrate the data from the CRM, ERP, and point of sale system by considering their backend database servers or through the exposed REST API from this system. Here, this table shows the system, each of, each of the system and their database server used. For the ERP, the backend is MySQL and we need inventory, store, product details and categories table. 
for a point of sale system backend is postgres and we need sales transaction and reviews table for a crm we, they are only exposing via rest api so we are going to get the customer data using rest api so once the data is extracted next step is the data cleaning and transformation here we are going to standardize the product names unit of measures and correct any data entry errors as part of data cleaning and then we are going to aggregate the sales data by store region and product category which we require as part of our visualization and also we will be calculating the kpi metrics like sales velocity average inventory levels reorder points net promoter score and some more items which have illustrated in the table so this table shows a set of kpis and the equivalent formula we are going to achieve in the transformation layer for example in the inventory turnover uh, rate is calculated by dividing the total quantity ordered by customer with total inventory quantity we have at hand next step we have to orchestrate the data flow to run at regular intervals by setting up the etl process to update the data warehouse regularly we can achieve near real time insights into sales performance and inventory levels so this ensures that the retail corporation can quickly respond to the changing market conditions so this gif shows the real time dashboard we prepared along with the data flow which were configured so i will give you a demo at the end of the uh, presentation step 4 is to create a dashboard on top of the transformed data from the bold detail so bold ba allows us to create interactive and customizable dashboard so from the sales and inventory data from from the retail corporation we can set up sales dashboard showing performance by store region and product category similarly for the inventory we can monitor the stock levels and highlight stock out and overstock situations at the dashboard level and we are going to uh, create kpi widgets showing sales growth inventory turnover and gross margin which we have cal calculated in the transformed data additionally on integrating customer details from crm we can further enhance our understanding about the customer behavior for retail corporation by improving its demand forecasting with the customer purchase history seasonal trends product popularity across age group or customer segmentation so this data will help in creating our personalized marketing efforts and also for loyalty programs we can also optimize the inventory based on customer preferences we identify in this dashboard and also track the buying patterns step 5 advanced analytics and predictive insights here uh, we can use the historical sales data to check the sales trends across each product category and based on which we can optimize our inventory similarly the overall customer insights will help you identifying the market trends and customer preferences so using all this data we can run a specific targeted promotions to drive sales thereby we can improve the inventory turnover so let me show the completed data flow and dashboard now so this is the bold etl this is the data flow i have added in the data integration slide from this yaml template you can see that the connection details i have provided for the mysql postgres sql and rest api and in the select category i will be furnishing the tables which we need in the initial load here i have extracted data reviews and sales transaction table from postgres sql so once after completing the yaml template i have to run this in order to load the data 
into the duct db which I will be using it for transformation. So, in the transform section I will be using the SQL expressions to achieve the formula output as I shown in the slide 2. Here you can see that the uh, net promoter score classification how we are calculating the promoters and detractors count using the formula by checking whether the rating value is greater than 9 or less than 5 based on which we are allocating the total promoters and detractors count. Similarly, we have uh, written all kinds of SQL expression to achieve the formula KPA formula as I shown in the slide 2. So, once after completing this SQL transformation layer, I will be scheduling this data pipeline under the schedules tab. Here you can control the recurrence count, recurrence of uh, the pi data pipeline. Here I have configured to run this pipeline every 15 minutes. So, once the pipeline is run, uh, run, the data will be moved to the destination table. For the purpose of demo, I have used the PostgreSQL as destination database. Once after running that pipeline, we can you can find the sales transform table in this schema. So, this is a table and the fields I have calculated using the transformation layer. So, once the data is ready, I have connected the data with Bold BI and prepared these ret uh, retail corporation dashboards. So, this is a multi tab dashboard which I have prepared for retail corporation, which provides insights on sales, inventory, and customer insights. In a single glance, I get to know the total sales amount, average inventory turnover, growth rate, gross margin and also about the sales distribution by product category and store location. You can also control the year and store location to identify or filter the data based on store location and check. Similarly, for the inventory management, I have created a vi uh, visualization that shows which are the product categories are in low stock in based on ordered units in a single glance. Here I can see automotive, clothing, electronics and toys categories are in low stock condition and then so since they are low stock I want to know exactly which product is low uh, is uh, very low and which I want to restock. For example, on clicking the automotive I can drill down to exact product which is very low. Here I can find both the air filter and tire are in low stock when compared to the ordered units. So, immediately I can take a remedial action to purchase more air filter and tire for the for uh, our store sales. Similarly, we can also check uh, overstock the products in a single glance and avoiding reordering for those products will be helpful in managing the inventory. Similarly, we can also calculate at what point we have to reorder the stock based on the uh, uh, current inventory ordered units and uh, and the minimum and maximum uh, purchase history. Similarly, we can do sales forecasting based on product category or based on overall sales. This will help you in uh, demand forecasting as well as your revenue forecasting. In the retail CRM dashboard, you can see the amount spent by top customers which you can use it for 
personalized promotions and age wise product purchases will also be here helpful in identifying the demand forecasting and for optimizing your inventory as well. Here I have shown the complete customer hist purchase history and top product categories by purchase. So this information will be helpful in optimizing your inventory as well as uh, preparing promotions and marketing efforts. And last in the retail store support performance you can track the customer satisfaction, their net promoter score and customer segments, sentiments. So these details helps you track the customer behavior with respect to your promotions and marketing efforts and its impact on these KPIs in real time. So by leveraging both Bold BI and its ETL, retail corporation have achieved several benefits. First, reduce stock outs. So ensuring the popular items are always in stock based on real time demand forecasting have reduced the stock out occurrence. Decreased overstock, second, which this helps in avoiding excess inventory and reducing the carrying cost. Third, enhanced sales performance. Real time data enables us to get to do quick responses towards market trends. Fourth, improved customer satisfaction. So better management means fewer stockouts and happier customers since they get their products quickly. And finally, we are able to improve the overall operational efficiency since the automated data processing frees up the resources which be, will be used in, for manual analysis for other strategic initiatives. So uh, we can conclude that Bold BI and ETL provides a robust solution for all the challenges faced by the retail industry, enabling better data integration, real-time insights, advanced analytics, and improved decision making. And this is one such example for retail industry. Similarly, uh, you can use Bold BI and its ETL for other industries as well with relevant to data processing challenges. And that's it for my presentation.